Welcome back to another episode of the Harbor Kids Variety Hour. Hey, Bruce! What is it, Doug? I'm doing the monologue right now. I've got a question! Why is the show called the Harbor Kids Variety Hour? It's not an hour long! Well, we, we just thought it was a snappy title. Okay, but don't you feel guilty about lying to the audience? Lying to children? Oh, come on, Doug. It's not that serious. It's just a name. Lies! Deception! I don't know how you can sleep at night, you monster! Well, I am a monster. But can I get back to the show? Maybe we can talk about this when I'm not standing on stage. You stand on a stage of lies! Doug, out! Okay, well, we've got a great non-hour show for you. Uh, let's just kick things off with sing-alongs with Bruce and Friends. All right, friends, you can come on out. Ah, uh, no, this way. Ah, uh, forward. Cut. Take two. All right, friends, you can come on out. What? What? Cut. All right, friends, you can come on out. Great, they've shrunk now. Cut. All right, friends, you can come on out. Okay, friends, you can come on out. Yay, we did it. All right, let's sing our first song, Jesus Loves Me. Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong, they are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me, yes, Jesus loves me, yes, Jesus loves me, the Bible tells me so. Alright, that was great. Now let's sing... In right, out right, up right, down right. I'm in right, up right, up right, down right, happy all the time. I'm in right, up right, up right, down right, happy all the time. Since Jesus Christ came in and cleansed my heart from sin. I'm in right, up right, up right, down right, happy. Sorry, I was muted. Master Matt! Thank you. I'm Reggie, and this is the news. Our first story. Police are continuing their search for a suspect who broke into an office supply store and stole a handful of papers. Here's a police sketch of the suspect. Ah. Uh... Our next story. A Texas man set a new world record by throwing an end zone pile on 4,000... Oh! Oh. We now go live to our on-the-field reporter, Dizzy, who's got some important updates about our local parks. Dizzy! Dizzy! Dizzy, we're live! Dizzy, we're live! Oh, 
Okay, I uh, guess we're having some issues there with Dizzy. Um, scientists have discovered a disease that can turn you into a goose. Symptoms include green nose, redness of fur, and being a news anchor. What's your favorite Bible story? That's my favorite too! I like the part where it's a story and it's in the Bible. Now for the last couple weeks, we've been trying to have the Van Fuzz Brothers sing a duet for us via Zoom. Well, it has not worked out, to say the least. This week, I understand the Van Fuzz Brothers have sent in their own recording in lieu of a live Zoom duet. Doug, did you get that recording? Ah, uh, I don't know. This is what they sent. Do you know what it is? Uh, I have no idea. Uh, can you just see if the guys in the back can figure out how to play it? Okay. I, by the way, sorry about that whole you stand on a stage of lies thing. Uh, don't worry about it. It's water under the bridge. Okay. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, the Van Fuzz Brothers. people were gathered there on the mountain. And Jesus appeared to them all, saying, All power is given to me in heaven and earth. Go therefore and preach my gospel to all the nations of the earth, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, teaching them to keep all the commands I have given you. I am with you always, even to the end of the world. Later, the risen Savior showed himself to all his eleven disciples. It may have been in Jerusalem, for he told them not to leave the city, but to wait until God sent them his Spirit as he had promised. Jesus said to them, When the Holy Spirit comes upon you, you shall have a new power, and you shall speak in my name in Jerusalem and in Judea and in Samaria and in the farthest parts of the earth. Jesus led the disciples out of the city and over the Mount of Olives near the village of Bethany. He lifted up his hands to bless them, and as he did, he began to rise in the air, higher and higher, until a cloud covered him, and the disciples saw him no more. 
While they were looking up toward heaven, they found two angels with shining garments standing by them. These angels said, O oh, you men of Galilee, why do you stand looking up into heaven? This Jesus, who has been taken up from you, shall come again from heaven to earth, as you have seen him go up from earth to heaven. Then the disciples were glad. They worshipped their risen Lord Jesus, now gone up to heaven, and went back to Jerusalem. There they were constantly in the temples, praising and giving thanks to God. Well, that's going to about do it for today's episode. Thanks for watching, and we hope you have a great week. See ya!